Tony. How are you? How are you doing? I'm doing, doing great. I'm doing good too, thanks. I don't know. What about the music back then? Did you enjoy it? Oh yeah, that was the beginning of rock and roll. You know, 1957 or something like that. Elvis came out with um, Heartbreak Hotel, and that was the first time a, a record had been done with, uh, you know, like four four piece band. That revolutionized the music industry. And then the Beach Boys, you know, Brian Wilson came along, and he uh, he was the first artist to, to actually produce. He wrote, produced, and performed in his own songs, and and became you know, the biggest force in music at the time, along with the Beatles. And so, yeah, I love the music uh, back then. Well, I actually feel like I should have been born um, in the late 17 to 1800s. Really? So, yeah, you know, everybody uh, everybody has a, this sort of phony vision of what they where they'd fit in. But yeah, I really liked the 50s and 60s. 50s and 60s were fun. They were definitely fun. Now, weren't you once a junior Olympic diver? Wow, you read something somewhere. Good job. Um, yes, I was, but that was when I was a kid. When I was, I was, I was a swimmer and a diver when I, from the time I was like seven or eight years old, up till um, uh, twelve years old. So I had a whole career as a, and I held some national records, and uh, I was a junior Olympic diving champion, and uh, so. But then when Leave It to Beaver came along, it kind of got in the way. You know, it was like. Uh, didn't have enough time to work out on the springboard and and work uh, eight hours a day. So, do you still swim today? Well, if I get in a pool, I have to. Yeah. Oh, I mean, <laughs> no, I well, I, I it's actually a great exercise, so I do enjoy swimming. What's your favorite memory from Leave It to Beaver? Well, I think the people I met and um, I learned the business from you know people who really knew the business. Uh, not that they don't now. They, I mean, the the people nowadays are amazingly talented. Uh, but it, it was, I, th I think, the people and the situations, and uh, it was easier, you know. You'd, you, we did our show in three days. You wouldn't think of doing a film show in three days in today's world, you know. It's just too difficult, too complex. How old were you when you were Wally? I was 12, 12 to 18, and then we came back and we did a new show in the 80s uh, where I was the father, and we did another 100 episodes. Wow. Well, you know, we it's the only show that's uh that's been on the air continuously for 50 years. I mean, the only scripted show. You know, a lot of sh like I Love Lucy was has been on forever, but it's been on and off the air. We've been continuously on the air for 50 years, which I think is just amazing.